to me Back into my arms Home where you belong Come home to me Come home to me If home is where you are Then home is way too far away TV light of blue and white Just can't fall asleep And I move over to the space where you should be Even halfway seems so far over mountains and diamond stars and everybody has their own way home come home to me come home to me back into my arms home where you belong come home to me come home to me if home is where you are then home To kiss goodbye and wait for your return I'll be strong and hold on to The picture and the thought of you Getting all the love that you deserve Come home to me Come home to me Back into my arms Home where you belong to me come home to me if home is where you are then home is way too far away if home is where you are then home is way too far away Happy Gwen's Day. I'm Gwen and this month I pulled out like half of my eyelashes using these two fingers because they're curly and they get tangled. So there's like a little bald spot right here. Anyway, so I'm super excited because the month of January is almost over. It felt like New Year's Eve was yesterday, um, but it's been a pretty good month. And I've also reached a goal, you know, that like a personal goal of mine to do a Wednesday video every Wednesday of this month and I'm super excited and proud of myself because this is the first time that I've actually done it full out through an entire month and I've, I've actually had like a lot of fun so let's try and keep this streak going. So since this is the last Wednesday of the month I decided that I would do two, well I mean it's not really two videos, it's all on the same thing but um, I just did my cover obviously and then I was just like, okay, well why don't I do like a January recap? So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna talk about like my favorite things and like the highlights of January and shit like that. Let's get started. Favorite song for the month of January is Shut Up and Dance by Walk the Moon. I went to a party around New Year's um, last year with my friend Taylor and um, it was down at UD and when we got there, um, this guy was playing this song over the like the speakers off of his phone. I'm just like, oh my god, what is this song? I love it so much. And he's just like, oh, it's uh, Shut Up and Dance by Walk the Moon. I'm just like, oh my god. So I've been playing it nonstop. Favorite band I've been, I mean, it's not really even a new thing. I've just been on a hardcore One Direction fangirl rampage for like the past year and a half. So yeah. Favorite album right now, um, Megan Trainers just came out. I love her music. I love her voice. Love the way it sounds. I've covered, I want to say, two of her songs. So the like her official like first full album came out, and I love like almost every single song on there. I think Walk of Shame is like my favorite. But yeah, that's my favorite album for right now. Favorite show. I just started watching Grey's Anatomy on Netflix and I cannot stop because I mean I see people talk about it all the time but like I just didn't understand if it was supposed to be like a like drama or if it was like supposed to be serious or funny but I actually really love it. I still don't even know what I would call it but I love it so yeah. 
there's that. I mean, and also I started watching Empire. Um, it's pretty good. I mean, before I started watching it, I got like, a lot of people said it was just kind of cheesy and it wasn't very good. But then my aunt actually like sat me down and was like, no, you need to watch this. It's like awesome. So I watched like the first two episodes and I was like, well, good shit, Taraji, good shit. So I like Empire now. Oh, and then like Glee is my all time favorite show and that started back up in January. So there's that. My favorite food for the month. This is nothing new. My favorite food all the time is Chinese food. I love it so much. Um, shrimp lo mein is my favorite. And the uh, crab rag, rang, rag, the crunchy crab things. <laughs> my favorite word. I used this the other day. I actually just decided to do this one. My favorite word for the month of January is ragamuffin. I'm not sure what the actual definition of a ragamuffin is, but my Aunt Patty called me that one time and I was really in my feelings for like a week and a half because I guess I'd, I, I think it was like a really bad day and I just looked really tired and she was like, you look like a ragamuffin, you can't leave the house with me. So yeah, so I used that the other day and I was like, this is really funny. Favorite nail color is what I'm wearing now. Um, I think it's like Snooky or something. I don't know. My cousin let me borrow it, but this is what it is. I love it. I think it's gorgeous. I just really like blue, I guess. So yeah. So I would say the best day of the month was probably New Year's Day because, you know, like everyone just feels good. Everyone's just like, hell yeah. It's the first day of the year. I'm about to knock out all of these New Year's resolutions. None of us did it. Um, one of my New Year's resolutions was to cut back on soda, though. And I've been doing really good on, like, with that. And apparently, if you're, like, from up here, you're not supposed to say soda. But I've always said soda, so... Soda. And I don't really think there was, like, a worst day of this month. It's, it's been a pretty good month. Um, the worst thing about this month is that it's not over yet. We have a few more days. Um, that's pretty much the month of January all summed up into... How would I set myself in? <laughs> all summed up into one for you guys. From me to you. So, yeah. Um, but I am really, 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 really excited about February. Valentine's Day is my all-time favorite holiday. Um, no, I don't have a boyfriend. I usually spend it alone, but I usually have the best time by myself. I get my nails done. I go out to eat, usually with my mom, but she's married now, so it's probably just gonna be me. Which will be okay. Anywho. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited about that. I'm also super excited because it is my birth month. Son, I'm gonna be 20 on February 19th and I am so excited. I don't really have a lot of friends so I'm not having a party or anything but um the videos are gonna be awesome. I'm like excited about my Valentine's Day video or cover. I haven't decided what that's gonna be yet. I have a show coming up um in February which will be fun. It's gonna be at Wright State. Um, I'll put more details about that in videos to come. And then also, I have a really exciting, fun video surprise for my birthday. Um, there's gonna be a lot of other people involved, and I just, I'm so excited, and I can't wait for everybody to see it. So yeah, that's my January recap, and I hope everyone has a gwintabulous day. Happy January. Baby, she's just the only thing that